It's the smart guy here. And even before the Jets fired Coach Sala, sitting at two and three, I got them at 10 wins. I still have them at 10 wins. Here's how they get there. Coming up next, they play the Bills. They will lose that game. They'll be two and four. Up next, they're at the Steelers. They're going to find some way to win that ball game. Their season will be on the line. They'll get it done. They're three and four. They head to the Patriots. They blow them out by at least two scores. They're four and four. They are at home against the Texans. Some way, somehow, their defense is going to be a little bit better than the Texans' defense. Aaron Rodgers is going to step up against the young kid. Now they're five and four. They're rolling. Jets head to the Cardinals, riding high. They blow that game somehow, some way. Five and five. Next week at home against the Colts, win six and five. At home against the Seahawks, win seven and five. At the Dolphins. They blow that game, seven and six, even without Tua. Next, at Jaguars, they win, eight and six. At home against the Rams, they win, nine and six. At, at the Bills, they lose again to the Bills, nine and seven. And in the season finale, at home, playoffs on the line, they beat those Miami Dolphins in a cold weather game and finish the season 10 and seven. Book it.